Audrey Vosick says she was a straight-A student before another student started tormenting her more than two years ago. It's been horrible because I've been the one suffering all the time, like every day. Vosick has trouble remembering these days, but she will never forget the day she says she saw Mallory Shawpot's fist coming at her face out of nowhere. She turned around and punched me in the jaw and it's caused my head to slam into the concrete wall. Leaving her with permanent brain damage. It was just a severe concussion and then it was complex migraines and post-concussion syndrome and now they've just determined that it's probably never going to go away and I'm going to struggle for the rest of my life. The lawsuit against the Ankeny School District, the high school principal, vice principal, guidance counselor, a teacher, and the bully's father states they knew all about the problem but did nothing to protect Audrey. That's what they told us was the best thing to do was to ignore it and avoid it and it would get better and instead it just got worse. To make matters worse, the student was given a school spirit award for her anti-bullying talks required as part of her punishment for assaulting Vosek. The high school senior now takes all her classes online at home, terrified to go near the school. My high school years have been ruined. She took those from me the day she started bullying me, and I'm never going to get that back. Bullying has an emotional and a physical toll on people that lasts a lifetime, and it's never going to go away unless the school district puts a stop to it. Now, the Ankeny District released this statement saying Ankeny Schools is sympathetic to the physical and emotional issues described in the students' reported experience. Bullying behavior is taken seriously and not condoned. We investigate every report and do not take any allegation lightly.